All right. Hello, everybody. This is Dan Bull coming at you from North Hollywood, California. You notice headphones and lights and cameras everywhere today. I'm shooting a little test video with the guys from Presonus. And we're going to check out the Studio Live 16 channel digital mixer, which so far has been fantastic. So uh, what we're doing is uh, mixing some microphones together. I'm going to play you through the microphones we're using. I've got a 65 Empire here right in front of me. And I've got just my straight off the shelf custom shop strat. And uh, we're going to play with some microphones and show you how this digital mixer pulls this off, which has been, for those of you that have been watching my webcast for three or four months now, it's the audio has been the trick. So I'm going to put some headphones on because I'm here, kind of here doing this by myself. And I'm going to run you through some stuff and uh, hopefully you can get an idea of what's going on behind the scenes. So right now I have all the guitar mics muted. Uh, so you're just hearing me and you're hearing the pick scratch from my little little theater mic right here. So I, you, I wear this theater mic just so you know because when this mic is right next to my mouth I don't have to put any gain on it. Otherwise it would pick up a lot of the room noise. And even now it's picking up some. You can hear a little echo. Um, hear that coming through. But if I was using a regular lapel mic this would be booming. You know, it'd be crazy. So uh, the first mic that I'm using is sort of what I consider to be the standard in the studio. Uh, every studio I've ever been to in LA all the time, top studios in the world, here in New York, in London, Oslo, Bob, everywhere, it's the Royer 121. So I'm gonna turn that mic on right now. And you hear a little strat noise there as that comes in. <laughs> Sounds great by itself. I'm going to mute that. Next, I'm going to use, I have an old Sennheiser MD421, which is the big uh, sort of oblong, fat-shaped mic you've seen everywhere. Um, it has a very different tonality than the Royer 121. So I'm trying to mix these together so it sounds kind of normal and human, not like a certain microphone. So here's the 421. <laughs> You can hear how much brighter that microphone is. Let me go down here to the clean channel. Back over to the Royer for comparison. This is a ribbon mic now. Now let's combine them. And here you go. It starts to get a little more natural sounding, right? Now, those are also two different speakers. Uh, so now what I'm going to do is bring in a Sennheiser ES314. And this is the predecessor to uh, this microphone. Uh, this is a 906 Sennheiser, which is sort of the standard now for guitar miking. But before that, the ES314 was the one. This microphone's from the early 70s, I think. <laughs> Now I'm controlling this all with this PreSonus mixer right now. I'm not really doing anything other than just hitting mute buttons right now. And um, I could be doing this on the screen of the computer I'm using. There's a universal controller for this that makes it where it's just point and click. But I'm a guitar player and I have a guitar in my hand and a mouse already. So I'm, run I'm, I'm running out of hands and brain power. But lastly, I have a room mic. But um, if I had the universal controller up, we could all be doing this point and click. Uh, and lastly, here's a room mic, which I just have a vocal mic that we're using, so hear that echo? I can bring the room mic up a little bit. All right, let's bring in the Royer with the room mic. I'm going to bring in the uh, MD421 on the other speaker. And I'm going to bring in the ES14 just for a little different vocabulary so it gets really close to human ears.
right down to the clean sound. I don't have a foot switch here, so it's a hand switch. <laughs> So I'm listening to headphones right now. It sounds a little brittle. But um, the mix you're getting out there should hopefully be a lot warmer. And uh, so what I'm going to do right now, I'll go a little bit off script here, is I'm going to grab my webcam and I'm going to show you the PreSonus mixer. If I can do this. Woohoo! There we go. There we go. Thank you. Oh, there's my office. So here's the PreSonus mixer. You can see the meters going as I talk, as I play. So you can see here are the mic labels. There's the Royer on channel 2, MD421 on channel 3, ES14 on channel 4, room mic on 5, and last but not least, that's me. So it's a beautiful thing that we got going on here, and it works astonishingly well. And I want to say a big thanks. Let me do it this way. Ha, 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 ha. I want to say a big thanks to all the guys at PreSonus for coming here and doing this. Um, I have a few PreSonus guys here in the office with me who don't want to go on camera because they're all really shy and really drunk. But, uh, just kidding. They're not drunk at all. They're just really stoned. Um, just kidding. They're really... Uh, I'm saying this because it's the opposite of the truth. These are the nicest, coolest guys in the world. And... <clears throat> I am a L.A. smartass. But, um, so anyway, you get the idea. So what I'm attempting to do here in the future on my broadcast is make a really nice sound, um, mix it well, and then bring it in to a live webcast so we can get a little more of, uh, a little strat noise, a little more of the uh, rock and roller, you know? <laughs> In my ears, it sounds really good. Now, well, this is our first attempt at it, so I'm not guaranteeing that what you're listening to right now is perfect. But we're on the way, with the help of PreSonus, of doing this, and I think between our two companies, this is going to be groundbreaking web demonstration techniques. And uh, so tune back in next week and see how we do. Once again, thanks to everyone at PreSonus. Uh, the guys that are here in the room, thank you guys. Everyone at home at corporate headquarters, we love you here, and we look forward to making this work perfectly. So I'm going to sign off right now, and... Uh, a little loud guitar going in the background. A little crunchy strat. All right. Thank you again, guys, and we will see you soon, I hope. Take care. <laughs>